Hello you guys and welcome back to my cooking channel. Today I'm cooking my kitchen. I'm cooking chili relleno. That's the name of the pepper. <laughs> I know I'm probably saying it wrong. But anyway, um, I'm going to stuff these peppers. Um, like I said, I'll put it down in my description below. So this is all of the ingredients that when you stuff these pepper, you use, um, well, some people use the stick, the mozzarella stick and stuff, but longer is uh, mozzarella cheese. It really doesn't matter. And plus, these is real big. So I'm using different kinds. Um, I'm using these kinds. I, I guess they stuff these with the mozzarella stick. And stuff but anyway whatever but uh it's so easy well this will be my first time making i'm not gonna say it's easy because i have never made it fresh but it's just <clears throat> you use uh this is for the egg yolk uh when you uh and then like i said i'm gonna record it so you guys can see how i make it and this is flour use one and a half cup of flour um normal time when you use eggs you use three but these is two these is the extra large eggs so i'm just gonna use two okay so so this is only the stuffing for this now from the side i like to turn mine into a burrito um so you know stuff it you know first you stuff it with the pepper and then once it is all roasted and stuff, um, this is going to be my, um, I'm going to turn it into a burrito. Most people use different kind of meat, but I'm going to use the ground beef. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to do, now they do, after everything is done and stuff, now they do uh, serve this with Spanish rice as well. But I'm going to, um, make mine with ground beef might put uh refried beans in it and stuff so and this right here but you guys are gonna see once that i get everything you know start cooking and stuff you'll see where i'm going at okay so i just want to come back to show you guys the ingredient first and this probably be uh at the end of my video because once that i cook everything it pop you know uh make my plate is gonna be the first intro on my video okay so i'm gonna go ahead and wash my peppers and i'm gonna roast it so you guys can see i'll make sure that you guys see what i'm doing <laughs> all righty so i'm going to get started with this first okay Okay, you guys, so now I wash my peppers off. <clears throat> now I'm going to go ahead and roast it in my oven. And sometimes people roast this on the uh, day aisle on top of the stove. But I'm, I don't have, I'm just going to roast mine in the oven. Okay, so now I'm just going to spray my pan. Oh, the pepper does not stick. Might have to use two pan, you know, because I got a lot of peppers. So you see how I'm doing that? Because <clears throat> I'm going to roast these on both sides. About um, five minutes on each side. because I don't want to make my video too long. Then these right here, I'm going to put in another pan. I'll be right back. Okay, 
I didn't think I was taping you guys, but I guess I am taping. Put these on here. Guys, I'm gonna see how this this is my first time and <clears throat> doing this. So and then what I do, I kinda even though I got all on here, so I'm just gonna spray the top but not turn it over. Okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna put in my oven. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and I'm going to uh, roast the, they said, uh, put your oven on bra. Okay. Okay, so here we have it in my oven. So now you guys, <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and do my Spanish fries. Okay. Because I'm making my Spanish fries out of this package and stuff, so uh, <clears throat> the the inscription is on the back, you guys. So I'm doing mine on top of the stove. So, yeah, so you buy this kind of brand. <clears throat> it's going to tell you how to make it. So, see, I <clears throat> put a tablespoon uh, olive oil. So, that's what I'm going to do now. Because I got two packets, you guys, so um, I'm using two tablespoons. And if I just only had one package, then I just use <clears throat> one tablespoon. Let that make sense. And two cups of water. <clears throat> okay, I'll bring that. I think you then. I think you just put your rice in. Just kind of stick it up. Yes, yeah, so I bring this up to a bowl before I put my Spanish rice in it. Okay, so now I'm going to put in my rice. And then you just, after you put in your rice, then you just put the top on and simmer for 20 minutes. And like I said, the ingredient is um, on the back of the package. If you if you guys buy this kind of rice, okay? So what the <clears throat> I'm sorry, the instruction would be on the back of the package. Sorry about that. I said ingredient. <laughs> My husband in the background corrected me. So that's it. Now I'm just waiting on my roasted pepper if I can steam it. But I'm gonna go ahead and do my ground beef, you know, on my other side dish. That's why I'm doing my uh <clears throat> my important stuff like the side that that Spanish rice and the ground beef miss. Alright, I'll see you guys in a minute.